The right side of the above figure mainly lists the programming languages for each part of the system. The YH818, a system is mainly composed of the following parts. A. Main card. The main card uses C or C++. And the main technical requirements are high real-time performance. That is to say, not only do it well, but also do it well within the specified time. The main card has added artificial intelligence real-time module interface and artificial intelligence real-time processing based on the original electronic jack ward machine. For example, the YH818 ANJM main card adds a 1. Artificial Intelligence Real-Time Module Interface. Can is used as the interface of the Artificial Intelligence Real-Time Module. Theoretically, 109 Artificial Intelligence Real-Time Modules can be connected externally. For applications with harsh electromagnetic environments, artificial intelligence real-time modules can be connected externally through the optical fiber to CAN method. Specific analysis for specific situations. Please contact me directly. Add to input signal. According to the real-time performance of the input signal, it is divided into high-speed signal and low-speed signal. High-speed signals are usually less than 1 microsecond, and low-speed signals are usually less than 1 millisecond. The YH818 ANJM main card is equipped with one high-speed input signal and one low-speed input signal. A3. Relay contact output. The contact output is mainly used for electrical isolation. The YH818 ANJM main card is equipped with three relays. It can simulate warp stop, weft stop, emergency stop, etc. It is used for traditional looms, low-end looms, etc. Please note that the action time of the relay is usually tens of milliseconds. If the action time is required to be less than one microsecond, Please contact me directly. A4. Non-volatile storage. Non-volatile storage is used to cache the data generated by the artificial intelligence real-time module. These data are very important and will be used as digital assets. They are necessary for future value added services. B. Controller. The controller uses mixed programming. Python and C. Python is mainly used for artificial intelligence and supports online programming and online debugging. For example, a Wi-Fi based webcam. C is used for real time. For example, Real-time data from the main card is uploaded to the central database. It is recommended to use an enhanced controller, V1. Based on the basic controller, a 10-inch human-machine interface is used. V2. Python Online Programming and Online Debugging B3 Wi-Fi and Gigabit Network For example, 
Wi-Fi is used to connect several web cameras. Gigabit network is used to access the central database, etc. B4. Improve computing power, etc. C. Free tool software. Free tool software running on the computer is mainly used to interpret real-time online detection data from the main card. Free tool software comes with at least 10 years of industry experience in the weaving field. For details, please watch the relevant video. D. Computing power, etc. Computing power includes cloud computing, central database, etc. The programming language can be Python or other programming languages. The other programming language here can be programming languages that have appeared now or in the future. They all exchange data with the central database. Even switch different versions of the database, such as rebuilding the database based on the original data. D1. Cloud computing. When computing power is insufficient, cloud computing can be considered. Just like a job that cannot be completed by one person can be completed by several people in collaboration. Even some jobs are handed over to artificial intelligence, silicon-based life. For specific analysis of the specific situation, please contact me directly. D2. Central Database. The permission of the weaving factory is required to access the central database. Please note that allowing access to the central database can realize other value added services in the future. The central database mentioned here includes disaster recovery measures, off-site storage, and other data security. Please, let us know if you have any doubts. We are willing to provide free technical support. At the same time, we learn from engineers. Thank you for watching this video. Goodbye.